this is Dr. Bev Knox and you are listening to my psychology tutorials learn psychology while you sleep in Western societies people are living much longer and the number of people over age 85 is growing dramatically indeed it is becoming commonplace for people to live beyond 100. In old age, we reach Eric Erickson's last challenge, integrity versus despair. Integrity refers to a sense of honesty about ourselves and a feeling that our lives have been well lived, so that Facing death is neither scary nor depressing. For Erickson, the psychosocial challenge of late adulthood involves how we view our life, not whether that life was easy or trauma-free. The crisis at this stage can be triggered by events that highlight the mortal nature of human life such as the death of a spouse or close friend. The crisis can be triggered by changing social and occupational roles, such as retirement. Resolving the final challenge allows us to come to terms with the reality of death. If we have many regrets, lack close relationships, or are angry about getting older, we may resolve the psychosocial conflict with a sense of despair instead of integrity. Although Erickson's theory paints a rather mixed view of old age, a great deal of evidence suggests that older adults are more satisfied with their lives than was traditionally believed. One recent study of older adults between ages 65 and 92 found that life satisfaction generally increased over an eight-year period. However, people of all ages want to find the meaning of life. But meaning often becomes a preoccupation for the elderly. As people grow older, they perceive time to be limited. So they adjust their priorities to emphasize emotionally meaningful events, experiences, and goals. For instance, they may choose to spend more time with a smaller group of close friends and avoid new people. They may spend an increasing amount of time reflecting on their lives and sharing memories with family members and friends. As they look back on their lives, older adults report more positive emotions than negative ones. The message here is that older adults want to savor their final years by putting their time and effort into meaningful and rewarding experiences. To the extent that they consider their time well spent and can live their final years gracefully. This result is as especially likely if throughout their lives they have worked hard to maintain their physical health. Despite the physical, social, and emotional challenge of aging, most older adults are happy and healthy. Except for dementia, older adults have fewer mental health problems, including depression, than younger adults. Indeed, some individuals thrive in old age, especially those with adequate financial resources and good health. All aspects of human development result from a complex interplay of influences. These influences include genes, hormones, family, social ties, culture, and an individual's motivations and actions. 
We all play active roles in our own development. We are not passively absorbing our environments, nor are we solely ruled by our genes. How we experience each phase of the lifespan depends on our own perceptions, the social support we receive, and the choreographed dance between nature and nurture.